Hey yo, check this out. Um, it's your boy Picasso Allen Poe, and today is uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to get out the habit of calling myself Picasso Allen Poe. I, I really don't even want to go by that no more. It's Picasso Verbidelic. All up to hell with all that Picasso Allen Poe stuff, but I'm so used to saying it's a habit. It's Picasso Verbidelic, and today is May. What's today? May twentieth, two thousand and sixteen, six forty-five p.m. And uh, man, I just. I just want to say, man, to a lot of people out there, to younger cats or whatever, older cats, middle-aged cats, whatever age you are, don't stop, man. It's gonna be people in this life. It's gonna. I'm gonna give you some. I want to give some advice. Don't stop if you're doing music. If you're a doctor. If you want to be a lawyer. If you want to be a beautician. If you want to be a mortician. If you want to be a computer scientist or whatever. You if you want to bag groceries. Don't stop. Don't let nobody deter your dreams. I'm telling you, because there's people out there, they, 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 hey, what's up, man? But they really don't want to see you make it. They don't. It's just being real, man. I wish I'd have did more of this stuff that I'm trying to do now when I was more vibrant, when my word had more bomb, when I was a little bit more powerful, but my mind wasn't writing. I, I, I wasn't at the level with, that I need to be to, to get it. I was just so into me. But now, just to give me some advice to you people out there might need it. You might watch it. And like I said before, all my videos are primarily done that I do on this channel. Just do them so people can watch them after I'm gone, so people can get this long. I just something I just want to do my little Picasso thing I'm doing. But uh, man, be careful who you take photos with. Be so careful who you take photos with. This go for anybody and anywhere because that's a part of your history. I've taken photos with people, and sometimes I look at them photos like, wow, I don't even like what this guy stand for. They might do the same thing with me. I don't like what this girl stand for she don't like what i stand for be careful who you take photos you taking a picture with somebody make sure they stand for something make because that's a part of your history that's a part of your life that's energy right that you putting out to the atmosphere it's some people that i look at like i don't want to take a picture with this guy or this girl not that i think i'm better because ain't nothing better about me i ain't i'm nothing better about me i just ain't that kind of dude but i'm but i'm real big on energy and i'm real big on how you how, 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 how the people i'm around and I spent a lot of time alone, probably 98 percent of my time alone. And I, I had I, I gave my, my mind time to ferment and to grow and to grow like foliage and to to to, to expand and be and, and, and just know myself. And I know myself. So I'm telling you, I'm giving you some real advice. Be careful who you take photos with. If you're if you're a recording artist out there, be careful who you record with. Be, be, if you produce, be careful who raps in your tracks. If you're a rapper, who be careful who tracks you rap on because that's a part of your history. I don't care how good the beat sound. If they energy not good, step away now. If you're watching this right now, step away. Do your own thing. Find somebody who got a good spirit, somebody you connect with, somebody who who, who means you well. Because I, I you, you do that stuff and you look back at that stuff 10 years and they come back to haunt you. If, you, if you're around a person and, you, and you're doing your best, and you, if you're around a person and you're doing your best and you showing them, you, if you're around a person and you're showing your best from the bottom of your heart and you know from the bottom of your heart that you mean well, you're trying to show them goodness and they're rejecting you, love yourself. Self-love. If you're around somebody right now, the person you're looking to the right, to the left, to the left, to the right, if they and you know that you know you care for this person and you love them, whether your girlfriend, your homeboy, your mama, your sister, your brother, your auntie, your nieces, your nephew, your co-workers, or whatever it may be, and they still cold to you and stoic and monrose and and and, and, and apathetic with no energy and they're just being all dry like you ain't doing nothing, step away. Make yourself happy. That's what we do as humans. We we devote so much of our time to making people happy who don't even care about us, that don't even matter. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I don't know if everything I'm saying is right. I just want people to feel good. I don't want people to, to feel like I felt over the years. I don't want people to waste time. You know what I'm saying? Be careful who you take pictures with. Be careful who you record with. Be careful who you work with. Be careful who you share your secrets with. My God, we so quick to just tell. It's a lot of things I put on Facebook and Twitter. It's a lot of things I keep to my soul with me and God. Be careful who you tell your secrets to. Be careful who you share with. Because sometimes people might not, they'll kill you. They'll just, have you ever just shared your energy with somebody? Your, a good moment with somebody? And then one second, they, with that dry, negative energy, they just break it down. And I've been negative before. So anybody watching, yeah, you ain't talking about him. Yeah, I've been negative before. And it's a dream killer. They dream killers. They're killing your dreams. Don't let people kill your dreams. I don't care how. I ain't one of them kind of dudes that's caught up on the youth. I'm for the youth. I'm for I'm for everybody. Youth, the old, whatever. I, I'm, I'm, I'm the young. 
Gentile Jews, Muslims, Christians, Jehovah Witness. Just a, I'm for the human race. For anybody, as long as you good, we good. Man, be careful with all that stuff I'm telling you because I know this mistakes that I made from being a younger, a younger, a younger dude in this game. Learn to present yourself good. Treat people good. That stuff come back to haunt you because you never, ever, ever, ever know who you're going to need in the long run. You be thinking like, oh, man, I don't need him, F him. You never know. You never know when God going to bring you back down to to your to, to level. Man, I done had money. I done been on tour and been back down standing on Jalo Mama couch, standing on Jalo couch, standing on Jalo sister couch. That's just what it is. Anybody can be humble. Anybody can get it. You know what I'm saying? Be a man. Anything that I got, be a man or be a woman. We need more men and more women. It ain't just on the men. We need more men and more women. Uh, uh, anything that you got, anything that you've done wrong, don't be afraid of it. It's just, we all make mistakes. Man, I, if, if I had a dollar for every mistake I made, I wouldn't be living in this little bitty apartment that I'm living in. Have some morals. Morals, ethics, values, they come by way of conceptual integration. There's nothing wrong, wrong. I'm not, I, I was born with morals, but somewhere down the line, I lost them. But now that I'm older, about the past eight, nine, ten years ago, I got them back because I realized morals is what, that's what makes you, that's what, that should just, it's better than the physical. You can look good on the outside, but does your inside look good? Have some morals, man. And I'm just spitting these, I'm just spitting these to the people that might want them. You know what I'm saying? People might not want to hear them. Ain't nothing special about me. Nothing special about me, and I mean that. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to do. I don't want no. I don't want nothing for nobody. I don't want to steal. Never steal. If you run a thief, move. Be careful who you let into your home. It's like Dracula. The only way Dracula can bring his energy, his evil to his home, you have to invite him. Be careful who you let into your home. I'm gonna end on that note. Be careful who you let into your home because once you let them in, that energy is destroyed. If I live somewhere and, some, and I've had negative energy in that house, I'm moving. That's just how I roll. Even if it just inconvenience me for a little bit. Be careful who you let into your home. Be good, man. And I don't want to be preaching, but I just, I don't know. Lately, I've been kind of in my own world. Let me, let me talk to the people a little bit. I don't even care if people watch it now. If it's, even if it's five or ten people that get this, that's people that got it. Picasso Allen. No, 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 no. Picasso Verbidelic. Remind me, I'm not Picasso Allen Poe. I don't like being called that.